Okay, just general comments. You guys came in here as a favorite. You guys just kind of came up slowly. You guys dominate the competition until the sled. Just talk about, you know, what happened in the sled and what kept you guys from winning the whole thing. Well, uh, I'll say, like, we really didn't. It was our first time doing it, but, uh, like, we really didn't have, like, our technique down to finish the sled. Yeah, I mean, when we went on it, we were <coughs> expecting to, uh, like, just run it and be able to get it right. But what we forgot was you got to keep your feet wide as you're doing it. And that slowed our time down by like 30 seconds, 40 seconds almost. So I know it sounds like an excuse, but that definitely would have helped us out. Now, uh, as far as everything else, were you guys pretty familiar with, with the competition? Anything new to you, tire flip, the, the reps, anything anything different for you guys? I mean, we had, we had bench at school every day. That was, that's just the usual thing. Um, what was kind of new to us was probably the sled um, and then... This thing right here, this little walk thing that we were doing, that was kind of new to us. We've never done that before. Now uh, let's talk about recruiting. We'll start with Matt. Uh, Matt, talk about some of your latest offers um, and, and some of the schools that, that are talking to you right now who's coming to see you during spring evaluation period. Um, latest offers, I, I just got a few offers from Boise State, Nevada, and Oregon State. And um, during springtime, spring game, and spring practice and stuff, we're going to have a lot of coaches from the Pac-12 coming through. And uh, I know Aziz got a few offers from SEC schools and ACC, so they're going to be out here trying to um, interview him and do uh, some notes on him. So, yeah, that's just about it for me. You got any favorites out of those, Matt, right now? <laughs> nah, I'm not, not really going to put that out there yet. I'm just going to wait until National Signing Day to tell everybody. Now, Drew, uh, you're probably going to benefit most from the two guys flanked by you. Uh, what schools are talking to you right now, and what schools do you expect to see? Well, I have, I have Washington State. Nevada, it's um, pretty much it. I'm not really sure. I got for guys like a couple. You got any favorites right now or any school sticking out to you that you want to hear from? No, not really. Not really. Besides Oregon, maybe. Oregon's it. Now, Aziz, you committed to Stanford a week ago. Um, talk about that. What, what led you to commit, you know, uh, kind of early in the process? Uh, it was just a it's a wonderful opportunity to be able to play at such a high academic school and um, with the academic prestige and then they don't play they don't play bad football I mean they just won the BCS 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 bowl game so they beat they kind of beat up on Virginia Tech so I mean their football's there and I'm, I want to be part of that tradition that they're trying to trying to do now Matt says a lot of SEC schools and ACC schools are coming to see you uh, are, are you still open to schools coming to see you or are you pretty much locked down your recruitment well, I'm Stanford bound, but um, there's, you know, the admission process is um, kind of rigorous in, um, at Stanford. So I still have a couple schools that I'm still open to right now, and um, we're going to see. Now, talk about this recruitment process for the three of you guys. You know, guys kind of all different levels. You know, Aziz, of course, you committed. Matt, you're still in the process. Andrew, you're trying to get more exposure. What's been the toughest part for any of you guys? Any of you guys can answer. Uh, probably the toughest part. Is at the beginning stages when you got to get your film out there. I mean, coaches are busy; they they don't really have that much time to see your film. But once they get to see, I need. I mean, me and my teammates they can play. They can play football. So I think once once we get our film out to everybody we need to, me I'm committed. But once they mainly them get their film out to people they need to, so that's gonna start rolling in. Yeah, I think I think Aziz is right about that because uh, from the get go he had his tape out like almost a month after season ended, and I didn't get mine out until maybe two months ago. So both of us are actually getting late exposure. But once we started getting our name out there, once the teams and uh, coaches started hearing about us, we started getting uh, more recruitment, more offers. And I expect the exposure that Aziz got to get our whole team and um, Andrew and my little brother some, some more offers. Let's talk about uh, the season. Last year you guys were on a tremendous run until you guys lost to Folsom. This year, uh, what are the goals, man? Is State the ultimate goal for you guys? State's always going to be the ultimate goal. State's... I mean, our team, we lose no expectations. The expectations the same. Our expectations was go to state last year. I mean, that we didn't accomplish that. So it's going to drive us even more during the offseason. Our team's working right now. So we feel nothing. We feel with the way we want to play, if we can achieve that, the Thunder's going to be roaring. <laughs> yeah, we just have to take it one game at a time and just keep pushing forward to our main goal. That's state.
Yeah.